Hello everyone and welcome to Tipsy. If you are new to this channel, please consider hitting the like and subscribe button for new post notifications and updates. For more details, do not forget to check the links below this video description. Without wasting any much time, let's dive directly into our today's episode. So in our today's episode, we are going to be introducing you to top 7 soccer prediction site that you can actually use to predict over 2.5 goals. So the first in our list that we are going to use today is actually zakabet.com. So I'm going to copy this link and open it in a new tab to show you how this website looks like. So but actually even though as we are using this website to predict our over 2.5 goal strategy, we should always keep in mind that we should not always choose the games that have actually been posted on the site. Always. We should always make sure that we use a second site in order to check the performance of the home and away team before selecting that particular match to include in our bed sleep so as to improve upon the chance of winning. So this is how the front page of the site actually looks like. When you come here, this is actually the over 2.5 prediction list. You can see here actually, what you are going to notice is that these are the themes that have actually been predicted as having over 2.5 goals in today's series. So actually, as I said before, these leaks or teams that have actually been predicted as will be having over 2.5 goal strategy should not just be accepted just as it has been placed here. Why? Because not all of these teams that have been predicted will actually have over 2.5 goals. If you can to approve this or to be certain about this, let's check at the yesterday prediction and see if all of the matches that were predicted here actually ended the way it was being predicted. So let's come back to yesterday and check if this was true. So if you see, for example, the first here, like uh, Voledam, was predicted as over 2.5 goal. But if you check here, this match ended 1-0, which means that this actually was a failure. If you check the second, you are going to notice that it was possible. So if you see all of this list here as the result, if you check here, what you are going to realize is that not actually all of this team actually ended over 2.5 goals. Which means that even though this has been predicted, it is always a good idea to go through it, making sure that you are going to predict just the best or you are going to select just the best in each or along among these predictions that have actually been submitted here. So, but what are you going to do in order to make sure that you do not pick teams that are actually uh, that are, that will actually not end as over 2.5, just as we have seen on the first, uh, like on this first prediction that was submitted here yesterday. The best thing to do as a strategy is number one, always make sure to have a second site which is actually a kind of site where you can actually check the performance of the home and away team to detect if the possibility of scoring can actually be possible or is not going to be possible. So some of the sites that I actually use most of the time is actually stat area. But in most of my videos, I've actually used stat area a lot of time. So today, I'm not going to use stat area. I'm going to use sofa score. Okay, let's say today we are here on sofa score. What are you going to do to make sure that you do not enter into this kind of trap that uh, teams have actually been predicted as having over 2.5 goal strategy, but at the end it doesn't end it as 2.5 or over 2.5 as it was being predicted on a given site. One of the things to do is to make sure, for example, if you come back to this site, for example, like on our today's prediction, like if you see like this uh, Ahmed City versus 
graph chart was over 2.5 always make sure to like uh, check on the home and away performance of this team on your second site that you are actually going to be using. If you come as an example, I will come to Sofa Score. Let's assume that it was Brentford versus Aston Villa, as in Premier League. So, what you are going to do as an example, make sure to bring your mouse on this match and click on it. As you do so, what you are going to realize is that it's going to be loaded at the right hand side. Of the screen what you are going to see actually you will see uh, this uh, written you can see like the pre form like the pregame form of Aston Villa as to Brentford what you are going to realize you can see the last matches that were the last five games that they had you can also read this preview that you have here about Brentford and Aston Villa if you see here for example when the odds are actually 2.9, the expected chance of winning is 34, but this team actually win 10%. If the actual winning is 34, but this team now win 10%, it means that the rate of scoring for Brentford will be very slim. So it's not going to be a good idea to check this as over 2.5, because same way Aston Villa also have the expected chance of winning as 41, but now it's actually 40%. This is to tell you that if you actually go for over 2.5 goal here, it might end it as 1-0, just as we have seen on the other on the prediction side that I showed you that ended 1-0. So the second thing to do is actually to always come here on this area that says standings and check the standings of your home and away team. You can see Aston Villa as Brentford. If you see they have played 18 matches, win seven, draw one, and they have scored. If a team will play a total of 18 matches, scoring only 24 goals, it means the rate at which the score is very, very slim. As compared also to the Aston Villa of 18 matches, scoring a total of 21 goals in 18 match, you will notice that the rate of scoring is very slim as well. So this kind of game, we cannot actually predict it as having over 2.5 goals. So this is the strategy that you should mostly be using when it comes to prediction of over 2.5 goals, just as we have seen. Most importantly, I waited for this match to be over so that we can really share something more as I was really wanting us to have. So uh, this match that ended with uh, Brentford and Aston Villa, I really wanted us to take a look at... Uh, the prediction that we're actually talking about so if i click here again what we are going to realize is this match ended 2-1 it is not worth of course taking the risk of putting it as over 2.5 reason being that if you look at the time where the second the third goal was actually scored is actually at 83 minutes this is actually to tell you or to confirm the fact that the performance of the home and away of Brentford and Aston Villa is not worth taking the risk of putting it as over 2.5. You can see if this could not have happened, like having a goal in 83 minutes, of course, this match will have also been a failure. So, of course, it's not worth taking that risk. But most importantly, it is always necessary to come to this area that says standing, making sure that you always check not always the overall performance but always make sure to check both the home and the way performance if you come here you click on the home what you are going to realize you are going to see the performance of the home if you see as for Brentford they have played 10 matches of uh, their win four draw one they have lose five and they had 12 goals if you see here the rate of scoring here is actually about one point you know 1.3 1.4 of um, having a, a, a ten, uh, having a twelve goals for ten matches, and receiving or conceiving twelve as well. So it's also always a good idea to also check the away performance, and the away performance. Of course, they have ten. They have played ten matches, scoring uh, ten goals and conceiving sixteen. So this is actually what is very important here by making sure we check the home and away performance of our teams 
making sure that they actually have a good striking rate or scoring rate and uh, that is when we are going to take that possibility of having over 2.5 goal strategy so of course let's go to the second side list in our today's episode so the second in our today's episode is actually over 25 tips.com so let me also copy this and open it in a new browser so that we are going to see how the page the front page of the site looks like so this page actually looks like this of course these are actually today our prediction of over 2.5 goals that you can actually include them in your best sleep and uh, making sure that you make out the best selection on these choices that are actually here so of course as i've said when you come here make sure to choose the league or the team that is actually playing here and of course the tricks that we have just talked about make sure to come to your second site like this one for example to check the home and away performance of your team making sure that it is actually having a good strike home and away performance before accepting to include them in your sleep as an over 2.5 so of course the third in our today's list is actually arrow bets this is it here i'm going to also open copy and open in a new tab so that we are going to see how it looks like so of course this is how it looks like when you are actually here on this site make sure to come here to this area you can see today you can also see tomorrow you can also see yesterday so these are today's prediction that are actually been selected as over 2.5 go strategy so of course what i was saying if you check on yesterday's prediction these are actually yesterday the result have not yet been displayed so of course it is to confirm the fact that we, i wanted to confirm the fact that not all of these matches that were predicted as over 2.5 ended 2.5 which means it is very important to use your second or third side to check the home and away performance if the strike rate of the home and away they have a good strike rate performance or the rate of scoring for example if the scoring rate is about 2.2 or 1.8 and above and the conceive rate is not too defensive as well like at least above 1.1 this is actually good to select it and include in your bed sleep so the third in our today's ep the fourth in our today's episode is actually hello predict so i'm going to open this hello predict so that you are going to see how it actually looks like the front page so of course this website looks like this Let's give it a wait why it's been why it's open. Okay, of course, maybe now uh, I don't know what is happening with this site. Maybe the site is actually um, taking a long time to open. Okay, of course. Okay, so it looks like this. If you look on today's prediction, this is the only game that I've actually been predicted as having over 2.5 goals. You see here Villari versus Levante. This is actually 2.5 goals prediction of today. So let's check of yesterday to see actually how the result ended on uh, yesterday match. So let's give it a wait why that has been uh, uh, reload has been loaded. Okay, of course, even yesterday the result have not all been displayed. So let's go to the next on the feet of our today's episode. It is actually tips tippers bet let me open copy and open on a new tab to see how the front page of this site actually looks like okay so this is how the front page of this site actually looks like if you come here you are going to see over 2.5 goals prediction of today you can see over 2.5 goal tips today these are actually matches that have actually been selected as the matches which we go which are going to end as over 2.5 of course please do not forget to make sure that you use your second side to check the home and away performance of your team making sure that the strike uh, rate of the home and away performance is great 
of at least over 1.5 to 1.8 and above 2 as the conceive rate should not be too defensive it should be at least over 0 0.9 to 1.1 and above so let's go to the next of course the seeds in our today's episode is actually king's predict so let's check how it looks like on a new tab of course this is how it looks like on the front page you see today of course they don't have prediction today they said they are expert are still working on the tips today maybe if you check on the later on you are going to see pasted tips of today but on yesterday of course if you see the hat predictions of yesterday of course if you check here what you are going to realize is just exactly what i was telling you of course out of one two three four five games that were predicted as over 2.5 of course only three of them ended correctly and two was wrong of course this is the reason why i said you have to use second sight to always make sure the home and away performance of these teams have been checked to make sure that they have a good striking home and away performance as compared to the rate at which they receive goals, they conceive rate, they should not be too defensive. If you make this mistake, you are going to fall in this trap of having at the end not uh, having the correct result. So let's go. Of course, the last one of today is actually four bets. Of course, this is actually four bets. Let's look how, let's see how we can. Uh, go to the over section to make sure that we select the over prediction of today so when you are actually here on four bet you have to come to this section that says prediction for today click on this drop down arrow and make sure to check the over 2.5 here and give it a way to load and when it's actually been loaded you are going to see all the over games that have been predicted if you see for example this is under you can see find the over this example of over you can see here this one just ended over that is two two you can see you can find look of look on all the over the over matches of course still do not forget to make sure that you check the home and away performance of these teams with your second site like maybe uh, sofa score or maybe uh, whatever site that you have but make sure that you check the home and away performance making sure that the strike rate of the home and away are actually very great and this, this team should not also be very defensive if they are too defensive of course it will be very difficult for them to conceive goals so our trick here or our aim here is to make sure that we look for those teams that actually have a good striking home and away performance of scoring and as well as they should not be too defensive they should have a kind of uh, the, 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 the way uh, the way at which they conceive should at least not be too defensive at least 0 0.9 1.1 1 .1 and above is a good team to pick for over 2.5 so thank you very much for watching and see you again